Hello peoples. So I have a request video. It's for a review of number 55, which is right here. And I'll show you the girl who requested it on my computer. Farah and Quinn's Fire Flyers. I'll link her below. Go subscribe. She has I'm gonna look up how many subscribers. Four. Four subscribers. Um, yeah, let's get started on the review. So, number 55. I'm gonna take her glasses off so you can see her face. Um, light skin, feathered eyebrows, hazel eyes. I got yelled at in my opening video when I said green. They're hazel. Whatever, it's still a form of green. Um, freckles, coral pink li lips, and classic face mold, if I didn't say that already. Uh, her hair is tied up in a bun because it's a pain in the neck to take care of, in, in my opinion. <laughs> so you're mostly going to see it in buns and her hair up and stuff like that, so, yeah. It is wavy, however, and it's dark brown. I know it might look black on camera, but I compared it to my number 25 doll, which is here. And you probably can't even tell, but 25's hair is darker. So her hair is like a dark brown. And I'll show you her neck thing, just in case. They've changed over the years. She just got her recently, and she looks like that. When I op took her hair net off, she had like all of these little hairs sticking out everywhere. So I don't know what was up with that, but I. I mean, this might sound bad, but I pulled most of them out because they're driving me crazy. <laughs> most things drive me crazy really fast, but I don't care. Um, yeah. She came with the outfit that is they sell American, my American Girl dolls in now the pink shirt gray skirt and the light brown boots with the green butterfly on it which I never understood because it doesn't match but whatever and if you want a review on that I have I think Ali I did a review on that in Ali's re my number 33 dollar review I'm gonna try to take her hair out so you can see what it looks like it might be a super curled now because it was in this bun for a couple of days but you're gonna mostly say her hair in buns anyway because her hair is a pain in the butt so here it is it's a little bit of a mess but there it is her messy hair I don't know it's just more flyaway-ish than my other dolls and I use water and stuff like that but it doesn't go away so I don't know I'm gonna have to find videos on how to take care of her hair or something. Oh, she looks so amazing right now. Um, but yeah, I'll show you the back. This is what her hair looks like. It's a pain in the butt, I promise you. It's like layered, I think. I'm not even really sure. It seems layered, but I don't think it is. See, like, all of these hairs are shorter. I don't know. It's layered, which makes it harder to curl. And I've tried my curling method on her hair. Don't like it. You know. So I just finger curl it. When I want it down, usually it's up. But what can you do? So if you're a gorgeous doll, I do recommend her. If you don't like her and you buy when you buy her, you can always return her. Um, my 55 dolls hair is a pain in the neck, which is why it's always up in a pony or bun or whatever. And, yeah, her name, I named her after Colette from the Shaytard, so some of you were questioning that when I did Camp Summer. And those are her glasses, because they look like Colette's glasses in real life. She has a red pair. Super adorable. Her fashion is, like, totally amazing right now. 
I'm blabbering too much about random stuff, so I am going to go, and you can comment, rate, and subscribe. I'm not going to make you in this video because it was pretty boring, I understand, but I hope you guys enjoyed it anyway, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye!